I connected this single garden hose pipe wall across my garden so every plant is covered through it and uh, I made a small holes at the root of each plant root so when I provide a very powerful motor right here to this garden hose every plant should get a decent amount of water so let's test this system okay friends so as, as you can see we are getting water everywhere where the plants are and I have also covered the holes where I don't need it because these holes got up straight into the sky and then the water just goes skyrocketing there so this is the end of the pipe and as you can see we are getting a decent amount of pressure onto there so there is no problem the the end right here is about 30 meters of pipe garden pipe right here or more than that actually so there is no problem with that so for the pipe I used this uh, half inch uh, garden pipe and wherever I wanted to divide the flow in two pathways I have used this half inch T which is commonly uh, you can get in any plumbing store okay friends so this is how you make this uh, drip irrigation system so basically you have to make holes where the plants are for that you can actually use a power strip and use your Dremel tool to drill holes for it now I used a smallest bit I have the another way to do that you can use this 12 volt car inverter hooked up to this lithium polymer battery I did that in my previous video so here is the LiPo battery connected to the inverter and the inverter is turned on let's plug it in the Dremel tool and uh, it should be powered up now Make sure your holes are facing downwards to the ground. Make sure to seal your end of the garden hose with using a lighter. So in the next video we are going to measure a very huge current of the arc welding machine. So hope you like this video guys and as always thanks for watching guys. Goodbye.